welcome to CVT Graphics 101. Today we're going to learn how to make an image appear as if it's behind the glass. Here we have the picture of a building and we're going to use this building to reflect this picture and make it appear as if behind the glass. First what we're going to do is take this picture and we're going to go to image adjustments and we're going to choose levels. Here in the output levels, this little black arrow, we're going to move it to the right until see how the picture fogs a little bit the colors so it appears if it's behind the glass you know that things behind the glass fog a little bit so I think that's 43 is about right so we're gonna put OK and now we're gonna use this picture and we're gonna choose from the transparency we're gonna choose color dodge so it blends with the picture with a very bright color dodge so what we're gonna do now it's reduce the opacity a little bit because it's too bright and also we're gonna get this image and apply a mask to it this little rectangle with a circle that's called a mask and we're gonna click on it and there you see that you created a new window this window will be the mask for this image so in that mask selected sorry you can click twice also and choose your display options but that's not relevant right now so uh, here we have a mask and in that mask we're gonna do a gradient here's a gradient tool and make sure that you choose black to white and put OK and here from the left to the right we're gonna drag and make a mask there we go now it looks more realistic the reflection doesn't have to go all the way throughout the picture just a little bit and now what we're gonna do is create a new layer and we're going to use the brush. You can press B as a shortcut or you can go right here and choose the brush tool. And now what we're going to do is go to this little arrow and we're going to choose Natural Brushes 2. We're going to put OK. And here we're going to choose this one, 25. It's called Pencil Thick. And it's a little bit tiny as you can see. So we're going to make this a little bigger. A lot bigger actually. Bigger, too big. Okay, there we go. And make sure that you have white as your foreground color. So now we're going to click here. There we go. And now we're going to make another layer. And we're going to use the same brush and make it a little bigger. There we go. Another one right there. And we're going to re reduce the opacity a little bit there we go awesome great and now last little detail we're gonna do is create another layer layer 3 we're gonna choose the marquee tool right here you can press M or you can choose the marquee tool and we're gonna select the whole picture and then we're gonna go to the brush tool and we're gonna go back to the basic brushes basic brushes press OK and choose a big one, we're gonna make it bigger anyways very big and we don't want hardness, we want a soft brush so we're gonna go all the way to zero and we have white again and we're gonna do a little white reflection here too there we go a little white little white right there alright now press control D so we take the marquee out and there you go we have a reflection with a little light you can also if you want to make it brighter you can double you can drag so if you select the layer and you drag it all the way to the new layer icon you can duplicate it and there we go you can have a brighter sunny day if you if it's too much you can make it a, a reduce the opacity a little there you go you have a glass reflection I hope this helps for your future projects and thank you for watching CVT Graphics 101 thank you have a great day